Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Yoshi and today I wanted to show you guys how I cord. So we are using melted chocolate from Android Pretty. And it is the Melka and Brown colorway. So yeah. First up I usually start with blouses, which are here on my side. I'm thinking that we should go like with the Melka blouse. So I usually hang my dress up and put the uh, like blouse behind it. Let's see if I can, can work this out. So yeah, like that. That's actually that's very cute. I think that that would look great. But usually, if the dress has like um, I usually go with like contrasting color compared to the actual like main piece so for example here we can see that this dress has like mocha and brown since the top part of this dress is brown I will go with like mocha and I don't know what the, what did I do here I took the blouse off of the hanger but I was supposed to dress take the dress off of the hanger so yeah so let's put the dress inside the dress well blouse inside the dress not the dress inside the dress you can also do that but we are not going to be putting two dresses right now on top of each other okay there we go and can we get the other one yeah so here we have our blouse with the dress i'm going to take this one this one off and put this to the side here so yes, there is our, our dress and our blouse, which has also a screw. Where did that, that come from? Okay, so second I usually go with either like legwear or headpiece. Right now I already have chosen legwear since my legwear is like really inconvenient place. But again, since the bottom is chocolate, I would, wouldn't would like boot brown socks since it's otherwise very brown heavy so I would put this mocha like tights or mocha socks that I have other socks already but you like want to contrast if you like put brown socks it's very like brown brown heavy so you really need to like spice it up a little bit because otherwise it's going to be so solid unless you're going to do a solid core that's that's a thing but this dress has like brown mocha coat and like white so if i wanted to do something else than mocha i could do like white socks i don't have that many white like i have ivory socks so maybe ivory, ivory there's some ivory also so ivory and cream socks could also work but right now I want to go with the mocha, so I would say like these mocha tights. Let's see if they <laughs> stay on the dress like that. So, um, we can also right now go to the accessories. This is like my brooch box. So I usually like to wear brooches on my like color of my dresses or like on the straps, but usually on the color of my like blouses, so. This is like a kumakumiya, it like, it's white and brown, it's like this cute little kumiya. I also have like this cookie bear from Sweet Joy House, so I got to look like what that would look like in my mind. This is a little too matchy matchy. I also have like this mocha button, but since the blouse is mocha, I don't like to wear like mocha on top of mocha. So... In this end, then I have like cookie purchase, but this dress doesn't really have cookies, it has cakes and chocolates. So you can also always think, think of the theme like this is a cookie, but there isn't the cookies, and but bears like go with everything that is chocolate related. So I think we could go with that. I don't know how it will hold up, let's see if it jumps down, but yeah. So next up, we are thinking of headwear. I have, since I also think of the weather, tomorrow is going to be like real cold and it's my like friend, friend's birthday and we're going to like a garden, like inside garden. So I think I'm not going to wear like a 
like headpiece like this or like a bow I'm probably going to think of like a, a beret which is more casual so my berets are down here here's my let's see if I can pick them up so this is my beret tag and right now I I know what I want to wear also like I have this like strawberry beret it would go great with this dress but this dress doesn't have strawberries so I also have this like cookie beret from AP but it's it has pink details so and I also have like a mocha beret but I'm not really feeling to like if you wear like a mocha blouse I'm not going to usually wear like a mocha headpiece like right now you can see I'm wearing like a brown dress with an ivory blouse and with a brown and ivory headpiece so right now I would go with like a brown beret so I would probably go with this one so you can see the color blocking and now the cumias on the floor okay let's put those back so yeah, the Kumias. Kumia is there, but let's put it to the side since it's gonna jump. So yeah, we're going to put the berry up since we're going to wear it on your head. And with that, I want to wear my new like Kumia ears, since those are like the kind of same brown. So there's going to be like lighter brown on the front since I'm wearing the ears at the front of the berry, and then there's going to be the berry at the back. So yeah, here we here we have our like hitch arrangement. Let's see if I can hang it ah, there. Can does it stay up? No. Okay, it doesn't. Let's see if I can just keep the beret there. No. No. Okay, I'm just going to put this to the side now. I'm going to show you the full coordinate at the end. So yeah. So there we go. And also with the cardigans, it is, it's cold, it's November already, so it's real cold. I'm going to take a cardigan. I have a couple of options. I have this like mocha cardigan, but again, since we all have a mocha blouse, I don't usually wear, like, wear the same color cardigan. I have this ivory, like ivory mocha cardigan, but again, it's very similar to the blouse color, so yeah. So I think this one would be the best. I have this baby distortion bright chocolate cardigan. It has a little broidery with a little pink ribbon, but that's that's a small detail. So, and I'm going to wear my hair on like braids, so my braids are going to hide this. So, yeah, I think that that would be very cute. Like it has like chocolate bars. And it is a little brown accent. The browns are a little bit different, but you usually can't get exact the same browns for everything. So I think it's it's close enough. It's this is a little warmer and this is a little cooler, but I think it's 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 good. So yeah. And then my jewelry box is behind here. Let's see if I can. Okay, so yeah. This is my like necklaces. So for necklace, what should we do? I I do not like would this this would work. This would be cute, but it has red inside it. So I don't know if I this would be the one I'm going to go with. It's very cute, and the browns is are exact similar, but again it has like brown and like it has like ivory and pink ice cream on the inside. And yeah, I have this chocolate macaron. We can check how this one looks. Okay, they're stuck again. Let's see. Okay, the donuts are married. No, please do not be married like this. What what has happened? It they are usually aren't this tangled together, so I don't know what's going on in my jewelry box. Oh, again. Okay, please. Yes, thank you. Okay. Let's see. So yeah, this one is it is a nice brown. It's a little darker, and since I'm wearing the cardigan on top, it's very blend blending to that one. It has gold, which is great. But I don't know. I don't think that that's the one that we're gonna go with. I have this cookie one. It's 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 from Cupot. It's this cookie 
Cookie necklace, it's close literally everything in my wardrobe. It it has a little like contrast. It has the ivory bow, but this one had like ivorish and white on also on it, so I think this could be a potential option. And I also have this cookie necklace. Again, with the theming there isn't like I don't have chocolate necklaces really so with like jewelry I just if it's if the color matches it's usually like it's okay yeah I think I will go with the cookie one so yeah and then let's put that back and we can put this to the dress color and since the kumia had like whitish ivory on it so yeah that's that's okay yeah there we go okay something like that and then we have to let the cardigan yeah i think that's cute so then we have our rings my rings are here i have browns on this one and then i have like pinks under this one but we don't need pinks right now so we're just going to look at this one so I have this one, it's really a perfect match and since I'm wearing the brown cardigan I would say this would be like very good. I also have this like chocolate heart. This would go thematically probably more. So I you know my camera cut so which shows I have we are wearing like Tomoka tights so I really just have like two pairs of shoes. I have this brown pair and I have this brown bear. Bear. Pear. <laughs> yeah. Um this is a really dark brown and this is a more lighter brown, but these are very uncomfortable to wear. So I don't know. I really don't know which ones should I wear. I do have some like mocha like like platform like sneakers. Which I would wear. And I might actually go with those since. But in that regard, if I'm going to go with the mocha sneakers again, with the color blocking. But since it's already. It's already November, so. If I wear like the mocha, where is them? Where are they? Where they are. So if I wear the like the mocha, like tights, it's very cool already. So if I wear these like Musée du Chocolat brown, like crew socks on top of them, then there's again like the color, color looking. So there's a little like darker brown, and then I can wear the like the mocha sneakers. So yeah. This is the probably the full coordinate that I'm going to come up with. I still don't know about the necklace. I'm still thinking about the necklace. I don't know. I really like how this looks. It's like you can't really see the sides, so it doesn't just matter. But I really like how this like ice cream looks with this dress. Yeah, I, I like that a lot. So I might, I don't know, I'm probably got, going to put this both out and when I, I'm i going to wear this, I'm going to like test both of this on, so yeah, I think I'm going to do that. But yeah, that's how I coordinate usually. It's a lot of color blocking and usually you don't want to put like the same colors, like at the top and bottom so you want to like you, like change it up like with the, when I'm like now going with like mocha shoes I'm going to put like brown socks between the mocha mocha so there isn't going to be so much of the one color color so you are going to be like it 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 goes the look looks looks more like clean because there isn't so much of one color. Always there's you can always wear just one color that's always great but for me, I personally like really, I like color blocking a lot. And yeah, I really didn't choose a bag for this outfit actually. Well, I don't know what I'm going to wear for a bag. 
Yeah, I probably needed to think that, think that, but since this video is getting a little long, that's the like the main re like the main thought pattern pattern that I usually do with my cards. So yeah, I'm going to now put you next up for the full card on on me, and you can see all the like the final details and changes. <laughs> So yeah, I hope this was inf like helpful and a little informative on how to make coordinates and especially like with chocolate dresses. So yeah, I was Yoshi. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like, comment and consider subscribing. And I will see you next time. Bye!